Good afternoon, I am Takama Sok, and welcome back to the finale of Star Fox 64. Now with significantly more Star Wolf. And just as Leon says, they have new ships, and they aren't here to play any longer. So they'll start barrel rolling. They have, they'll really like to do the old uh, loop-de-loops. And if you're down a guy, it does make it a little bit harder. If I can just get one out of the way, that'd be great. Okay, good. Ah, I got Wolf. <laughs> yeah, they're uh, they're a lot a lot stronger than what they were. Just be careful you don't find the pillars like I almost did. Okay. Who coming? Who coming? Oh, he's following me right along. Hey. Quit it. No, I... Jesus, try doing that. There we go. I won't let you get away from yeah, this is a... If you have the, the basic laser, too... I see you've got new uh, this is a very difficult fight. The body. Yay, hey, look at look at Peppy go. Look at Peppy. Well. Y'all see that? Oh, I got him. <laughs> oh, wrecked. Uh, let me grab that. I don't know if I need these. I'd assume I do. All right, 3v2. We can do a 3... Almost flew right into me. I'm going to hit that pillar. Wrecked. Wrecked. Where's the other one? He is currently behind me. There's one more to go. Uncle Andrus! No, oh, he blocked all of it. Quit it. Where'd you go? I know you're over here somewhere. Give it up. You uh, I get it, Andrew Andros. <laughs> uh, who do you want to fight? You want to fight me or you want to fight somebody else? Homie, I just depleted like half of your energy bar. You're over here somewhere. I ain't fooled. Oh, there you go. Hey, no flying out of bounds. That's that bull. He did fly out of bounds. Look at that cheater. Look at that absolute cheater. You want to go? You're not welcome here. Wrecked. Hit plus 50. Give me that health. I'll go it alone from here. Fuck! No, Slippy's dead. Fuck! Alright, I'll see you guys later. Let me sure my wings are as open as possible while I fly through this minuscule hole. Alright, so this will look a little bit different too. Because this is like the, the true ending here. Which way you go, I don't believe. Actually, certain certain directions have certain power-ups, but... I don't even know if bombs are useful in here. I don't think so. True pain. Let's go this way. There might be, like, a quick way through it, but... I always assumed it was just a fractal pattern going through there, but... You're not going to notice a difference initially, but... Get some dental work done there. Almost. Well, it's got to be close. There you go. <laughs> you doing big suck? He's doing big suck. Get out of here. And he's gonna barf. <laughs> there he is, folks. The true form. So, Androd, you show your true form. All right. So yeah, this is a little bit of a different battle. Do not touch his little tentacles there because he will destroy you. I believe that is instant laser loss, instant uh, broken wings. Just pay attention to where he is. I think we have to shoot these things down, if I recall correctly. Oh, Jesus. Somewhere over there. Uh, at, least, at least I think that's how you do it. It's been a hot minute. Good lord. Alright. Oh, yeah. Slow it down a bit. Just... There you go. Got that one. The other one is behind me. So actually the main objective is, you see that little uh, bulge on the back side of him there? 
that's what you need to hit. And I don't remember exactly how to do that. I'm going to get rid of this first. Okay, got rid of his eyes. So it's back there. God, I need to be precise. Okay, just be careful when you're flipping around because you can. That's what you need to hit. Be careful when you flip around because it is very easy to not see where he is and just go flying right into him. Like, almost like this. I'm going to put some distance here. And I think... I think just get a little distance and then... I'm so paranoid that I'm going to fly into him. And don't forget that uh, barrel rolling increases your turn. Like, this is good. Okay, I didn't actually get him, but... Problem is you can't... I don't think you can really tell which way he's oriented here. Okay, I did get him anyway. So it makes it a little more difficult. Maybe the bottom of the bottom of the B. I'm gonna change the view, but it should be okay. Should be right over here. Okay, I got a lot of hits on him there. Got him. If I go down, I'm taking you with me. Not done yet. Or maybe he is. Not too hard if you know what you're doing, but don't ever give up, my son. But it can take a little uh, trial and error. Father? Big Papa James. All right, we do need to catch up with. Uh, follow me, Fox. Follow me, Fox. That's Falco's line. Right, we do need to kind of make sure you see which way he goes. Because he will lead you out. If you take a wrong path, I think it's uh, instant death. So just make sure you follow him. Why they decided to put this at the end, I don't know. Never give up. Trust your hey, that's Peppy's line. I guess it's technically yours first. But... Okay, well, left, right, left, right, left, right. Ow. Right. Okay, we're good. Not too long, but shoot him down. You've become so strong, Bob. Ah, thanks there. Thanks, Papa James. Boogoosh. And that's it. That's all she wrote. Yeah, bruh. Yeah. Easy. Easy win. What's wrong, Fox? Nothing. Nothing's wrong. Not gonna mention that, huh? Okay, that's fine, I guess. Ah, Slippy's okay now. <laughs> it just happened to be absent from the last fight. That's a real shame. Real shame is. It's a real shame in it. Okay, now we'll let the credits roll. We'll let the credits roll through that. Oh, there you go. I still don't think this one's as hard as the Super Nintendo one. I don't know why. For some reason, the hard path on that one just seemed really hard. What are you looking at? But yeah, still, nevertheless, this game is, it's been one of my favorites on the, on the 64 for a very long time. Oh, there's Cat. I wonder if Cat's there in uh, other endings. Probably not. I'm sure there's minor differences, depending on which way you go. Like, maybe Bill comes with you. If you, uh... Probably not. But I'm just speculating what could change. And there's still alternate paths. Like, you can do the first Star Wolf fight, and then go do the second Star Wolf fight, so it makes a little more sense in that regard, because why they're all... Obviously, they were shot down and rescued from uh, uh, whatever base that was. I forgot what that base was called, but... Shot down and got rescued and got new ships, which were 
much, much better than their old ships. It was a pretty cool fight, though, at the end there. Not a big level, unfortunately, at the end, but it's still fun nevertheless. I think maybe I would have preferred, like, even a shorter level. Instead of just the dogfight with those guys. But whatever, still cool, still cool. No complaints, no complaints. I really don't have many complaints about this game, if any, really. It's a little abusive with, uh, you saw just, just instinctively my brain goes to, like, wanting to mash L and R just to barrel roll all the time. Like, even though there's nothing there to deflect my life. I noticed that a couple of times when I was editing. I was just sitting there mashing that and... It's just, uh, it's just defense, like purely defensive and habit at some point, because you never know when stuff's going to come up behind you and get, oh, what is wrong with Peppy? Good lord. Look at all those doges. So many bills. Starbuck. We are in your debt. I would be honored to have you as part of the Cornarian Army. Oh, no, sir. We prefer doing things our own way. Oh. Great Fox is ready to go. Great Fox will cover you. It's time for us to go now. And that's it, for whatever reason. We'd love to have you in the court. Where do these guys go after that, then? They just kind of hang out in space? I mean, obviously, they already knew uh, James from them, but... Must be an entirely different organization. Again, this might be one of those things that the, uh, the manual says, and I just don't know. Because I don't have the manual for this game. I think there was a website back in the day dedicated to that. Like, it was only video game manuals. I don't remember who was doing that, but I think Vim. Maybe Vim was doing that. But there you go. I just remember spending hours on this game, and I was uh, 64, and I was a kid, kind of, back then. Absolutely zero complaints. There is a... I kind of thought about making a... Like a bonus, I don't know if there's enough content there to make a bonus episode. But there's a couple of warps and stuff that I didn't get to show off. Um, like maybe show what happens when you fail certain things, but I don't think there's enough there to justify another video for it. Like the two sectors connect. I might have gone over that, but on the easy path, I, I forget which one's X and which one's Y. I think X is on the right side. But there's a, there's a condition there where if you clear it, it'll send you to sector Y. So you go from the easy path to the hard path. And you get to do at least that, uh, I think, yeah, you would do that mission. The one with the missiles and Great Fox. Yeah, like I said, I don't think there's enough, uh, enough things to justify showing off. I did show some of the fail conditions anyway. If I was thinking about it, I probably could have crammed it all in the same video, but... I just left it all in. Wherever I died, I died. Oh yeah, 1997, I was... I was in my mid-teens in 97, are you kidding? Back as a kid. <laughs> Total hits! Hey, 1142, let's rank in. Or maybe I did rank in. Did I rank in? Do it prank him. There we go. Shouldn't have put the controller down. Hey! Hey! Oh, we finished first. Of course we did. Pretty pathetic showing there in Sector Z, but... Oh, Sector Z. Mm. Oh, Sector Y and Z are on both the same side. Okay. So that's X on the right, definitely, then. But you can see the kill count's probably way higher on this side than it would have been otherwise. What's the next path? Oh, hey. What? Corner uh, payment due for services rendered. V Venomian units destroyed. Total amount due 73. <laughs> okay. I'm assuming that changed. Yeah. I didn't. Better pay up, Doge. Better pay up. Right, I think you can actually move the. It's kind of a little thing. 
You can make them all look around. They're just showing off their 3D models and stuff like that. I don't think there's anything else uh, left to see. Training just shows you how to do everything. It's not really that interesting. Uh, versus, I don't have a second person, but you can actually play PvP in this. And then uh, uh, rankings, just that. And yeah, I think that's uh, I think that's everything there is to see. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed playing it. Uh, definitely a good good romp through. Star Fox games are always a good time. I probably could go back to the Super Nintendo one and be absolutely garbage at it, but for some reason I'm always okay at this one. Okay, I died a couple times, obviously, but. But that's neither hither nor thither, but that is Star Fox 64 in the bag. Uh, again, if I... I'm pro I, I say I'm going to do maybe a bonus episode, but probably not. I, again, I don't think there's enough content there to, to justify doing a second one. But it, that'll be somewhere in the future, not immediately following this. But anyway, that'll be it. This was StarCraft 64. Thank you guys for tagging along with this one with me. And yeah, great time. A+. I'm Takamasak. See you later.